Hello and welcome to the 16th tutorial in the Bootstrap Free Series. In this part we're going to be looking at button groups. We'll be using the source code from this 6th tutorial. If you don't have it, don't worry, there'll be a link in the description. We have looked at the grid system that Bootstrap provides plus the rows and columns and how they all come together. But Bootstrap doesn't finish there. No, it doesn't indeed. It provides several UI components to help create that awesome website. We will now take a look at the button group component. The button group component allows you to group buttons together, creating a menu like what you see in headers. You can use this with either a button tag, a anchor tag, or input tags, but it is recommended to use it to use with the button tag to prevent cross browser incompatibilities. So let's go ahead and open up our project in a text editor. All we need is the index.html. Like everything else, Bootstrap makes it super easy to implement. It's going to create a simple implementation, and what we're going to do is zoom in here and do diff. And, and in here, we're going to apply a class. This is going to be BTN group, stands for button group. This isn't something that we're creating, this is built into Bootstrap, which is great. Like I said, you can use anchor, input, or button tags, but button tags work best with cross browser, so this button is what is recommended. And in here, we're just going to simply say left. And for the button, we're going to add a, we're going to make its type so it's it will a button. And add a class. The class, we're going to add two classes button and button default. Again, all of these classes are just built in, so we don't need to worry about them. I'm just going to copy and paste this, change this to middle. Ooh, not middle, middle, not middle, middle and right save that and now if we just run this in our web browser there you go we have our button so we can click on them at the moment they don't do anything but you can obviously maybe use a bit of jquery use a bit of javascript uh, combine it with anchor tags do what you want uh, obviously your button i mean your button group depending on what your website is it will do separate things so on let's say a regular website on in a header or in the menu you click on it, you can go to home page, you can go to a contact us, you can go to about us so forth so forth or it may just be some sort of tabbing system so you can switch between I don't know screens on the same page the next tutorial will cover the button group toolbar if you have any questions feel free to message us at support at sonarsystems.co.uk the email will be in the description you can comment on this video or just directly message us via YouTube. All the required links for the source code will also be in the description. If you want to check out hundreds of more videos like this one for free, visit sonarlearning.co.uk. And as usual, thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day.